it's 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 pointless to try all this impeachment type stuff when someone is bulletproof. I don't think they understand the concept of what being bulletproof is. But but the man is bulletproof. I, I like really it. It doesn't matter what he says. It, it really doesn't matter. People love it. Oh, you know, saying go back to your own country when you're someone that's actually born in a country um, you know, is never cool. Um, but then I don't really, I haven't really listened to the whole context of the whole thing. But also, it's there is a hell of a lot of anti-American sentiment go around about these these kind of politicians, you know, this Omar bird and the, the, the Cortez bird. That's what I'm going to call them. The loony chicks. Because they are lunatics. They're, they're not... They don't seem like the brightest bunch. And they seem like opportunists. And they're, they're, they're the same as him anyway. They're all the same. So it doesn't really... So who really cares? Like, who gives a fuck anyway? But the... <sighs> the problem with it is... It's like they're, they're banging on about impeachment. About everything that he does. You know, they're, they're like some sort of... You know, some sort of ex-partner is in completely in denial going oh, if I keep sending them a text every day every five minutes telling them how much they love them they'll definitely come back to me you know what I mean it's that kind of thing it's going, if I keep staring at it like this she'll definitely like me it's like you know it's like what is wrong with you just why can't you why do you have to focus all your energy and attention on someone that loves having all this attention and all this energy focused on them. Like, well, I, I don't get it. I don't get what the what you think the outcome is going to be. Like, what's the game plan? There doesn't seem to be any sort of. There, there's no game plan. There's, there's there's nothing. There's there's a serious lack of intelligence. A lack of like, there's a lack of awareness about how this all works. There, there really is. It's like you you don't get it. It's, you know, there's a craving for attention. Like everything he says, he gets the media attention. He 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 occupies media space so well. He's like really good at doing this. Like, do you not understand like how good at doing this he is? He's he's sort of he's like he's a master player. You <laughs> know, he. He went from being a, sort of like a like a meme and a joke, and it's like, oh, wow, well, he's he's running for president. Like, surely this is just a publicity stunt. This is this is just for a laugh. And you know, he's not going to become president. No, 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 no. That, that can never happen. This is lunacy. You're talking lunacy. What are we talking about? He's going to be president. No, 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 no. That's not going to happen. And then he does. Because of how he manipulates the media to talk about what he wants them to talk about. All right, I don't see how anyone doesn't see what this is, but they can't. But they can't help it. They can't help it, and they think this enables them to win. It's like but you're you're like you're playing tiddlywinks against a chess player. Do you know what I mean? You're you're a Sunday league team taking on you know the the uh, Barcelona, you know with with ticker tacker, tick, you know. Spain national, do you know what I'm saying? You, this, this is what you're doing, you, you, and you're fooling yourself. It's like he'll get the media will talk about exactly what he wants them to talk about. It's and it's a fantastic thing to see. I mean, from a from a standpoint of if you want to take positivity away from something, you should look at it and go, well, "That's how you fucking do it." Do you know what I mean? Because you you can look at conspiracy theories about stuff, right? Now, a, cons a conspiracy head. Now, look at, I'll give you an example. So when they had the, like, the London Bridge attacks, um, or attacks, well, it was a multiple attack, attack, there were people out there talking about this was a smokescreen, um, you know, this this was a staged thing, this was orchestrated in order to, that I see some guy, who's a bin man, uh, saying how this was all orchestrated to, um, get media attention away from some scandal involving um, uh, one of the princes. Oh, who's the uh, Prince Andrew? Some sort of weird, sexy type stuff going on with Prince Andrew. And then I, then you know, I had talk, and I thought to myself, well, maybe it's just a distraction from Brexit. Go 
I wish we had more of those. But, do you know what I mean? That's, and that's kind of like, that's conspiracy loony land. That's conspiracy loony land. Okay, yeah, well, they, you know, it was orchestrated by MI5 to do whatever. No. But this is actually real. This is this is for real. Because I've already seen videos done in already, and it's like, he's he's, already, he's passed a bill, you know, which is completely done, denying migrants um, asylum who walk over the border who come from certain places. Like you have to come at a certain, you have to come in at a certain port, which happens in a lot of sort of countries. Where, you know, you have to come through an airport if you come from overseas. Blah 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 blah, which is a big deal. It's a big thing that's happened. But what's everyone talking about? This, just some throwaway comments going. Oh, go back to your own country. If you don't like America, and people love it because people love it because they don't like anti-American sentiment, and others like want to criticize America and this cultural blank blah 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 little fighting thing. And yet, the real shit is going on right in front, like literally in front of your face. It's literally this far away from your face. It's here. It's kissing you on the fucking cheek. We don't even know. Because the guy knows exactly what to do. He knows, he knows outrage culture. He knows it so well. What well, he says advisors do. The team, the team know what to do. He's got a better team than Drake. And why do I say that? Because I tell you what, you ever seen that Hotline Bling video? How silly Drake looks in it with his with his turtleneck and the puffer jacket and doing all this weird dancing like an old grandpa. He knew people were going to meme the shit out of that music video. He knew. And he knew those memes were to distract the fact that that, video, that song was a piece of shit. And it was just terribly annoying. Because Drake makes good songs. This is a bad one. But he knew. He knew. It's exactly the same thing. This is what's going on. You know, so the big story, that the big political story, the actual political story everyone should be talking about, it's just got blown away in the wind because they're like going, oh, you said these silly comments to these silly people. It's like, who cares? Who actually cares about these nut jobs anyway? Like, no one. When the real shit's going on. And there's so much stuff that actually goes on and he knows exactly how to divert your attention away from it and just let it happen. You know, just let it. And this happens all the time. You know, think about it's like, it's like every disease that comes out every year. Swine flu, bird flu, fucking rat measles. Oh, here's this new disease you should be terrified of. And what was going on at the time that you should have been concerned about instead of this, this very rare, like, you know, about three people got it. What was going on? I don't know. I was terrified myself. But something was going on. And it actually is, there's something actually going on. It's not like a conspiracy thing. It's like there's, there's actually stuff going on. You can see it. Now it's like, now we have even more, it's weird, we've got even more access to information. And But still, you can get you can get trailed away from it. They can just just snatch it away from it. Going, no, don't look at that. Look at this. Do you know what I mean? It's like, I don't know. You're trying to get on with your day. You know, and then someone comes in and gives you a massive strip tease, and there's a geezer, just in, like so. She's here, she's doing her business here, and there's a geezer over here. He's robbing you blind. He's fucking robbing the shit out of you. But he's just looking at you, transfixed like this, going, "Oh yeah, that's right." And, it, and someone's fucking robbing you. Someone's robbing you. It's not sucking your penis. It's, it's someone's stolen all your shit. But you're too busy looking at the spectacle. Oh, look at this spectacle. Do you know what I mean? It's, but in plain sight, there's a guy running around taking all your shit. He even does a poo. He does a fucking shit on your floor out of disrespect. Because he's like, <laughs> you won't even notice this. You could smell the shit. But no, you don't want to don't acknowledge you can smell the shit. It's amazing. And they, and you've got this group of people who, who uh, they don't know how to play a game. They don't know how to play the game. Like, it's like it's these, these these girls are like toddlers. They're fucking toddlers. You got an adult in the room going, yeah, oh yeah, yeah, saying, I know you were gonna kick up a stink about this bill I've just passed, but I know how to distract you from it with just nonsense of a throwaway comment. And that's all it's ever been. It's just him making stupid comments that everyone focuses on, and he gets all the attention. And they and how do they rise to the bait every time? How do you not learn a lesson? this but how do you not learn this lesson it, it baffles me the guy became president against all the odds from playing this game now this this happened almost three years ago right when he became president but the campaign started more than three years ago so i mean you you must be able to 
where are the experts advising people going well you know this is this is what he does this is his game this is how he plays it this is what he does like why can't you just rise above it and think about the bigger picture and be like uh, oh no 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 he's distracted no 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 you ain't no 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 you ain't baiting me into this discussion no you're not baiting me into this gang it's like you know it's like it's like insecure moments when a, a girl doesn't want to have a I don't know you don't want to have the real big conversation going you know a big conversation you know you've been through a phone seen some dodgy texts you're like come on bitch what are you doing here? well you got a small dick I have not got a fucking small dick. <laughs> like the most, the most insignificant thing. When you got a small dick, who cares if you got a fucking small dick? It still works, doesn't it? Still gives you pleasure. Still does the job. It'll impregnate her. That's the end. Of, that's the end goal. No, 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 no. You won't be concerned about what she said about your dick. And the whole while she's been fucking your friend, your dad, your uncle, the fucking milkman who smiles at you in the morning. She fucked all of them, man. But you don't care no more because she just commented. She just said how small your dick is. And you're like, oh my God, why do you talk about my dick like yeah, And voila. You don't learn the lesson. How, like, how do you not see this all in plain sight? It's the game, he's, the game he plays and you just cannot... You just have to rise to the bait. That's what I'm saying. From day, from day one, when the guy says, you know, some of these Mexicans come over the border... Are rapists, you know, some are murderers. You know, I'm not saying they're all bad, but you know, but I'm not saying the best. You know, he just said some, which is such a throwaway statement. I've always said this, it's like going some, like some, like some is everything. Some, someone ring me right now. Can you see I'm working, bro? Some is such a throwaway statement. It's like well, obviously some people are rapists, some people are pedophiles, some people. Like, some, any group of people can have some wrong-uns amongst them. It's such a throwaway comment. It was like, oh, did you hear what you said? It's like, yeah, some. It's like, you should have ignored it and gone, yeah, what's your, what you should have said to that? I'm like, what's your point? Well, yeah, well, yes, some people are paedophiles. <laughs> some people are rapists. What's your fucking point? That's not really a legit reason. But no, they fell for the bait the first time. How did you fall for the bait the first time and not realise what was going on? And keep falling for it again and again and again. And be like, oh, impeach him, impeach him. I'm like, what the fuck? Ignored. God, do you not remember? It's even at the end. It's just, remember, just ignore it. Turn the other cheek. What is wrong with you? Jesus Christ. You're supposed to be leaders. You're supposed to be people who people look up to. That's the joke thing, have you? But you're not. What are you? What the fuck are you? Like, who are you people? How did you get this? How did you get this position? And I haven't. Well, because I didn't want it and didn't go for it. But that's immaterial. Like oh, shit. I can walk into this. I can walk into a job blindfolded, not knowing nothing, not even being an American citizen. So I'm going, yeah, I'll fucking do it. Like that. It, it's it's baffling how easily manipulated it. it. It's just it's just. Wow, it's just like wow, you you you're jokers, man. You jokers. You deserve to, and you deserve to lose. Yeah, I hope you lose hard. That's all I can say. Like you know, you you won the losers' medal. It is yours. Wear it with pride. It's the only thing you'll ever win. Is the losers' medal. Congratulations. You played yourself, motherfucker.